So when, so you believe that John Lewis, when he gets up and says anything, is already discredited because of what he's failed to do since the civil rights era. He has done nothing. If, you know, John Lewis, bless his heart, you know, it took courage to do what he did in early life. But yep. what he has done now, he has, he has turned himself to his enemy, like a, like a little girl being beaten by daddy and joins daddy, like an abused woman beaten by her husband, he, she joins the husband. He has joined the enemy. He has joined the oppressor. And what he should do, if you're a real man, John Lewis, if you're a real, real hero, you stand up tomorrow morning and you look at the American people and you apologize. You have led them through decades of hell. You, you should apologize, say you made a mistake, say that you tried to work with them, but the Democratic Party has always been the party of abuse, always been the party of the Klan, the party that went to war to keep slaves, the party that's always been the destruction of black people. Mr. Lewis, you have presided over the destruction of black America, and you owe us an apology. And by but the I mean, fact, you're more concerned, well, he, he's more concerned about, about Trump being the illegitimate president, but John Lewis is the illegitimate congressman. So, uh, presumably, he, I mean, you don't believe that John Lewis is doing this on purpose or that other members of the Congressional Black Caucus are doing this on purpose, do you? <laughs> you know, that's why I love you so much, Tucker. You, you just, you, you're so kind, you're so genuine, but I know that you, I, I know that you hate BS. So, I'm going to tell you, all I've seen that he has gotten rich and people have gotten poor. Uh, the Black Caucus has gotten more power and influence. And the black people that are presiding over has gotten poor. More drugs, more gangs, less business, less home ownership, less education, more jail, more drugs. Now, if you did that in your job, you'll be fired. If you did that in any place else, you'll be fired. The worse black people are, the poorer we are, the stronger the Congressional Black Caucus is.